He was a decorated all-star, a legend in our business. The golf writers from previous generations tell me that Hogan and Faldo were a lot alike. But he played like a guy just called up from the minors. Okay, Kel, what are you thinking about asking me, bud, so just so I know where to go? Hungry, forever the kid whose first job was hauling trash alongside his father. Talking to those who knew him, the football analogies pop up, and Tim was an undersized but rugged, hard-nosed linebacker at the University of Rhode Island. Our former colleague Matt Janella said, quote, Tim was the greatest lead blocker in the history of the game of life. Professionally or personally, if I needed anything, he never once said no. Today, I lost a big brother. Maddie and I reminisced, and we both agreed that as you get deeper into life and further along into a career, what you come to value is working with good people, people who care, people who are unselfish, people who value getting it right, people with heart, people who make you laugh. That's how we all feel about Tim. Sad, no question. Crushed, heartbroken, angry, a cruel disease that would rob someone so vital, so strong, so bright as Tim was. And yet we're all thankful to have worked with a great one. Lifetime achievement in journalism. Good, you, can t <laughs> you think that's funny, don't you? Of course, he didn't see himself that way. He had his insecurities like a lot of us do. He said 84 for five spots in the office there saying 73. I want to know what the two questions are too. Hard on himself. Are we clear? Appreciate you. But he built a legacy. It's along with our esteemed panel of one, Tim Rosenfort. Newspapers, famous magazines like Sports Illustrated, Golf World and Golf Digest, and then on television with Golf Channel. In italics, underlined. And NBC. The first of several visits this weekend with the senior writer from Golf World magazine, Tim Rosenfort, who managed to reach Roberto DiVizenzo by phone. His distinctive ball dome and glasses. Built that legacy because he built relationships. Checking in with you, I hadn't seen you in a while. What did you learn through all of this? I mean, is this a serious thing? In the best Rolodex in the game, bar none. Why do you think this was the perfect storm this year that people are talking about the event like it's a, a WGC? From all the superstar par breakers to presidents alike, they trusted him. What's the greatest lesson you learned from this? You can't win at all costs. He broke stories. Dustin was walking down a short staircase. He did not break his word. Tough, but tender. We all who had been around Mr. Palmer in recent months were preparing for this day. And, um, and now that it's here, it's, 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 it's still numbing. Is there a better combination? No. And there was no one better than Rosie. Tim Rosefort.